Best of five, Roach. First match, majority of their outfit, red. One of my old alliances wanted us to call out lanes and... Yeah, but if you're gonna call out your lane, why don't you just get lanes? It's easier. Even though I know lanes, sometimes you're like, God damn it. Why do we have to do lanes? We should be all smart enough to just get it done. I hate to say it, it doesn't happen. Tony, I might not beat this no tonight. Shit. I'm not going to beat mine either. I went into it once and... Got two Johnny Storms and a uh, Mr. Fantastic, and the Johnny Storms are just blasting me to hell. No, you can do it tomorrow. I want to do it tomorrow. Is Ultimus's jaw enough red? <sighs> Broach, is Ultimus's mouth enough red? It's Ultron. Ultron. We've been talking That's about. We've been talking about Ultimus all night. I'm gonna skip him. Ultron is full gray. Got you, bro. Broach. Sinister's cape is red. Sinister, Sinister's cape is red. And he's like, I just unlocked Red Bolt. You don't have him? Yeah. Colossus has a red costume. Symbiote Spider-Man's wearing his regular Spider-Man outfit underneath the underneath the black one. I swear, I swear he is. Doctor Strange, nice. It's like you can't go down too far. Oh, I should take my I should take my six red star uh, Nobu. Too bad I haven't leveled him up. Okay, we go back to the top and we work our way down again. I'm trying to think in my head how much of Yandu's outfit is red. Miss Marvel. Good yeah, it'd be better if she was more than 55,000, but. I thought about Iron Man, but Iron Man really isn't that great if it is. And then I was going to take Spider-Man for the dodge to go with Carnage. So the little bastard was reading my mind. It was just like, I'm taking, I'm going to take. Well, She's Scarlet Pony, not red. According to Ohio State, Scarlet is red. See, my question is, is will I be able to withstand Captain Sparkle Finger's first blast? Because if I get rid of Doctor Strange, he won't be able to flip the buffs and he can't bring her back anyway. I almost took Doctor Strange away. I get rid of Captain Marvel 10 out of 10 times. Yeah, but the only way to get better is to take some challenges that are, you know, harder because you might find out hey oh my god this actually really works pick that daredevil get that uh pro brawlers combo with some marvel and dare uh deadpool oh he takes oh nice pick but yeah i'm taking the daredevil find assassin
funny how I came on to do a little bit then I was gonna finish editing a YouTube video and I haven't gone back to the YouTube video. I gotta do a YouTube video! And the last three nights does. Well, I've got six days worth of filming that I've done here. Uh, and at first I'll cut them down. You know, I'll cut five hours of streaming down to like 35, 40 minutes, and then I'll put them all together and I'll cut that down to like 20 minutes. So I'll take 20 hours worth of filming and cut it down to, you know, 20 minutes. Uh-oh, oh. somebody's Dr. Strange got slaughtered. I'm not saying who, but it wasn't me. Too bad it's only the first. Why do you think I went after him first? Honestly, we doubt Pony even knows why he went after Dr. Strange first. He was probably more worried about the res. I had not even thought about no armor. No, that's lies. I would never think that way. I, I know everything about this game backwards and forwards. I'm like that guy on YouTube who can give you every single stat about every single player at the drop of a hat. It's okay, Roach. Just the first of five. Now, if you win, then if you lose the next one, then I'd be worried. Oh! Do you guys ever take your red store? I used to do that. I used to take my sixes to buy five store credits, but unfortunately the redemption rates are not worth it now. They changed the redemption rate and decreasing what you get now isn't worth it anymore. They coming back. That Roach, they do. women only. Women only. So read, yes, I would, uh, I would not redeem them anymore like that. Does that day come out? They're going to do the, uh, they're going to drop the exchange back to what it used to be for the six. Do you remember them announcing that? They did that for like one day and then they took it back to the new way. It already happened. Yeah. We missed that. Oh, yep. well. They took it back for one day. I had 450. I was 50 short, anyways. Uh, I don't like your Proxima Midnight. It's ladies' night. It's ladies' night. The Captain Marvel. And we'll take a yo-yo. But yeah, it was, I remember, you know, when they changed the red star drop rates and all that, and then all of a sudden, you know, they gave us all the good news and then they released it and they're like, oh, did we forget to tell you we were gonna change all this stuff too? It's like, Jesus Christ, you guys are a fucking piece of shit. You know, if you're going to change it, just tell us. Would we be happy? No. But it's better to tell us before you do it than after. And then going like, oh, sorry, we didn't mean to do that. Oopsie, did I do that? I'm trying to remember who you have high. I want to get high, so high. I have no offense. I am a complete <laughs> defensive team. <laughs> oh, I didn't think about Quake. 
Damn it. It's a mistake. Rookie mistake. I think my eyes were too focused on Minerva. And she and he takes the storm. Storm luckily takes a while to charge up. <laughs> you had to. St I I've never watched an episode of uh, Miss Marvel. Mystique wouldn't be bad. She Ultron's actually a girl. He identifies as a woman. Nothing's wrong with that. If you want to identify as a woman, nothing's wrong with that. Gamora wouldn't be bad. Miss Marvel. She's not really going to feed anybody anything. Mystique. Yeah, let's try a Mystique. Okay, so we got Quake, Jessica, Hela. Uh, Black Widow and Storm. Hella would be the main big choice. Massive JJ. That's a huge ass fucking JJ. Bubba JJ. Okay, JJ's gone. Now he's gonna get rid of Captain Sparkle Fingers. Now we got to look through who we're going to take. I'm thinking Miss Marvel. Feed a little bit of energy, self heal. Psylocke, good damn choice. Koya is garbage. Mantis would be a good choice, but mine's too low. Crystal would be an awesome choice, but again, mine's really freaking low. Elsa would be good, but again, low. Scarlet Witch, maybe? Well, I got Scarlet Witch. I've got a 65, a 64,000 Gamora who has the T4 ultimate. You know you're an early game player if you T4 to anything and get more. Yes, I was an early game player. My first T4 I ever put on anybody was Yondu's basic. Because of the because of the clear the taunt. To clear the positive effect and stuff. Did Captain America. No, I don't have any I don't have I have a big Crossbones. I have a T13 crossbones, but I never put any T4s on. Trust me, I was so pissed off when they did not add crossbones onto either the Hydra team or Taskmaster's team. I was like, this is complete donkey shit. Don't die, Greg. Good, Greg. Good, Greg. Don't die, Greg. Good, Greg. God damn it. I should have just hit you with regular attack. Because now your Greg's going to die. He shall remain homeless. Yeah. Hopefully they'll rework them when they do the Black Widow movie. But now that that's pushed back a year. See, I should have killed, I should have killed Hella when I had a chance instead of bleed. Okay, this will, are you kidding me? That did not kill her? That's redonkulous. Okay, Greg's gone. That's fine. 
Yeah, one of these times, I'm one of these. Well, no, it's the yo yo that's keeping me. You can't do any damage to me. Yo yo is just. I got defense up, I got offense down, and then Minerva heal. And then again, yeah, you went offense, I went defense. And defense wins championships. I say that, then he's gonna slaughter me. Uh, all his ults are gone. Storm's ult's gone. Quake's ult gone. Psylocke's already used hers. Pew, 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 pew. Non-human. Oh, not this one again. This was way too complicated. This was way too complicated. <laughs> it's not that they're born on Earth if they are non-human. Question. Yes. Coach, we had a lot of questions yesterday. Ask them all. <laughs> yeah. I would consider inhumans as humans, yes, because they were born on Earth. Humans were humans first until the Terrigen gas made them inhumans. So yes, they are human. Yeah. Like Groot is non-human, Ultron is non-human, uh, Thanos is non-human, uh, Phoenix is human, even though Jean Grey is human, but the Phoenix technically is not human. She's still human. Captain Marvel is human. Yes. Say not, Star Lord say, is human. Say not born on Earth. <laughs> Pretty much, if they were not born on Earth. So, like Proxima was not born on Earth. I'm gonna get rid of your Proxima and your Glaive. Mutants are gone straight up, yeah. Technically mutants, if you look at it, mutants are non-human, but they are human. As guardians are, are approved because they were not born on Earth, they were born on Asgard. Just because they have a human form doesn't mean that they are human. Yes, symbiotes are symbiotes are out because they have human hosts. Just call this category aliens. How about that? Or I just or I just get completely get rid of this category. Leave it aliens. <laughs> so Hela was born on Asgard. I'm not sure about Scientist Supreme. I'm not sure if she's human or alien. I don't know. But I'll take, I'll take Loki and Hela. I don't, I'm not, I don't know much about Sinister. Like is Sinister or Scientist Supreme? I don't know much about their uh, history. Not born on Earth. It's supposed to be non-human. But as guardians aren't really human. As guardians aren't human. As guardians. I mean, we can start over. I don't care. We can pick a different one if you want. This one seems to cause a lot of controversy. Years old. A human lives to be a hundred if he's lucky. I was saying Scientist Supreme and Mr. Sinister. I'm not sure where they were born. I know their heritage either. Drax is not. Scientist Supreme is a human scientist. Okay. That's why I didn't pick her. I figured she was. We'll take a rocket. That way you don't get that way you don't get rocket with your tree. 
Which, what do you know about Sinister? N not enough. And this, like him and Stripe are mutant. Yeah, I think they're just, I think they're human in mutant form, I think. But we're not gonna, we're, we're not gonna sit here and, you know, argue well, this person is, I'm like, uh, you know, it's, we're only having fun. It's only a game. Yeah, Nathaniel Essex, Essex. If I remember right, in one of the X-Men movies, you know, he was played by Peter Dorf, uh, Dorfman or something. Gamora, good. I'm going to stay with the Asgardians and we're going to bring in Heimdall. Hi, Dale. We got to get rid of that 108,000 Thanos. That is going to be a freaking awesome brotherhood. Wow. Now, this is the hard part. Does he get rid of Loki or does he get rid of Hela? Hela's got to go. It's rid of Hella. Grabs Thor. Oh, that's a good pick. Okay, we can take Lady Sith to go with Heimdall and Loki. Seven, is that a seven red star Ronin? Yeah, I have a seven red star Ronin. Jeez. I just haven't leveled them enough yet. One of the guys that used to be in our alliance took him into uh, G13 or DD2 mm -hmm. and said that he was amazing in there. Yeah, I'm gonna take Lady Lady Sith or Crystal. This was an inhuman. Thank you. We'll take Lady Sith. I was really hoping they would bring out Lady Sith with the uh Warriors three. <laughs> but the way they killed them in As in Ragnarok, I was so disappointed of how they just eliminated the Warriors three that easily. There wasn't even a battle on anything. Nope. Okay. I think we go after Minerva. With Cole and Thor to wreck her. <laughs> Didn't do much. Aww. Now, we already have Drax Tawny, so we don't need to worry about that yet. Rocket will finish her, though. How big does Cole look there? Jeez. Cole is beefy. Heimdall's going to go after his brother Thor. They need to finish the Inhuman royal family. That'll be a long time, dude. You know, the rumored X-Force coming out, and then uh, the externals... Yeah, it'll be a long time before they go back to Inhumans. Settle for my fifth Marauder, finally, please. Well, yeah, they don't have five deal. Marauders. They don't have five, you know, they don't have five of a lot of people. Gambit. Gambit would be cool. You know, they talked about Beast how long ago? Think about how long Cyclops sat on the shelf. Red Skull was in the game since day one. He was part of one Medu of the... Medusa would be awesome. Yeah. Hey, Professor X, ultimate wheelchair throw. 
we talked about that some time ago and they're like no then the game would get like people would bash the game because you got a character you know in a wheelchair you're fighting a guy a handicapped person and i'm like uh then they don't well, know you know they could you know they could if if they're worried about that they could put him into his metal suit that lets him walk you know there are ways around it but and they're like what power would he have i'm like dude he could do just about anything Like a as long ass. as we don't come on, not tree. Oh god damn it! Really? You're gonna fight him with tree? <laughs> but yeah, you know how do you do the X Men without the leader? But K uh, <laughs> Gambit would be awesome, but I think that all depends on if they're gonna release that move, if they're gonna release the movie or not. Uh. I wouldn't mind seeing Kurt, Nightcrawler. Nightcrawler would be pretty cool. But it's more of what are they, you know, what's his skill going to be besides just jumping behind the person? Glaive well, already does. Yeah. No, uh, call, call me a skeptic, but I would have preferred to see Colossus with the uh, X Force, considering there should, there's no reason in any comic book history that Colossus and Phoenix should be the ones that are the uh, tag team. Well, the Colossus go they were until the, they or, were until about 19 until like somewhere in the 1990s. It was always Phoenix and Colossus or I'm sorry, uh, Cyclops. It's Cyclops. Col Colossus, I think, should actually be a brotherhood. Uh, Colossus has been in, I mean, I know we're going off, only off of modern stuff, but Colossus was the only other main character in the Deadpool movies. Why yeah. not put him with supersonic teenage? Maybe they up, will. Whatever that. Maybe they will, at, you know, at a, but I think I see him more as a brotherhood because back in, uh, shit, I don't remember the number, but when Magneto rips you know, the antimantium out of uh, out of Wolverine and then Professor X to make it to where Magneto can never hurt anybody again takes his mind away uh, Colossus leaves the X-Men to go nurse Magneto back to health and you know he basically becomes a brotherhood <laughs> 